My parents taught me that you should leave someplace better than you found it. I've always loved volunteering. I think it's because I love people and I like to meet new people. I like to work with people of all ages. The Chamber Ambassadors, that was one of my very first volunteer experiences and I met so many awesome people. I think that, that just reaffirmed to me that there were so many opportunities. Wichita State gave me so much and so I always want to give back to Wichita State. I mean, it was the foundation of my professional and personal career and it's so fun to be able to live in the town of your alma mater so I've enjoyed doing things with athletics and with the Alumni Association with the Board of Trustees and you know Wichita State is a big deal to me it always will be. I would say Cheryl is the best connector I've ever met. She connects people with people, people with organizations. She connects people through economic development initiatives and political campaigns. She even connects to the animals in our community through the zoo. Sometimes we'd be in uncomfortable discussions about projects we were looking at, and Cheryl made everybody in the room feel comfortable. Um, she made sure everybody's voice got heard and then worked through the problem until everybody in the room was comfortable with the solution we came up with. Um, so whether she's a peacemaker, uh, maybe that's the word for Cheryl, is, is friend and peacemaker. Her knowledge, her relationships that she has built throughout this community, she shares those, she introduces people, she takes that younger generation and really introduces it to the existing leadership at chamber level, at the city level. I'm not sure there's anyone in Wichita who knows more about Wichita than Cheryl. Uh, she understands the political landscape, she knows the nonprofit world, she understands business. She has a great overview of what's going on in Wichita and what needs to happen in Wichita so the city can continue to grow and change. We absolutely cannot stop now. For those that say, wow, things are going so slow, have we made progress? I mean, look back on the last five or 10 years, we have made so much progress and we certainly can't stop now. We can't let off the gas pedal. We have to keep pushing forward. Cheryl doesn't like to think of herself as building a legacy or think of the legacy she is leaving behind, but it is through the relationships that she has built, it is through those that she has taken under her wing, that she has mentored, that she has befriended. All of us who have been a part of her life, we are her legacy. Well, I think the end game is always to leave your community better than you found it and to do what you can as you go along. We all go through peaks and valleys of when you can give more, do more. So I think you just have to do what you can as you do it and help those that want to follow in your shoes, help them along and encourage them. We have got to recruit and retain talent um, as well as community leadership. And I think our future is very bright at Wichita and uh, in the community. Great things are on the horizon.